Yes, greetings to everyone, wherever you are, wherever you are. Welcome to the Food Improviser Freestyle Cooking Show. Today I'm going to make some dishes and um, I'm going to actually, you see I call it giveaway, recipe giveaway in full details, which means that you will be able to see exactly what I'm doing today from start to end, 12 and a half minutes. Okay, now I have three normal potato and then I have a half of sweet potato. As you see, I'm gonna first peel up these three of all this potato, sweet and normal. And um, after, I will, this one is going into the oven, right? And then I have a lax today, a very big lax. And then I'm gonna cook some rice and spinach with pumpkin. So let's join me, relax, no stress. If you're doing nothing, take a beer, sit down on the sofa and relax. Yeah, that's my dear people. To all of you who did not subscribe of, to the channel, I hope today you get some vibes and you know, show some love. If you like it, show some love. And you know, give thanks and praise to all those who already do it. Now, some spinach. This is very important, eh? you know, I, that's why I say today I'm going to do, because I, I do a lot of videos, right? And um, you know, as I said, a lot of time people say, oh, but I want to see how you do that. Well, today I'm going to show you everything. I'm going to wash out this spinach, you know, wash them with clean and nice. Cause this is something, you know, spinach, you know, greens is a, is a thing a lot of times when you buy them, you should wash them out carefully. But not just wash them out. I will show you something now. You see vinegar? I'll put some vinegar in the water. You know, make sure I take away all whatever it is, bacteria, this, that, you know, any any insects that are gonna be there, you know, kill them off, yeah. And I will chop it out of the parts that I don't want, you know. That below there, that, you know, take away that, you know. And then, after I chop it up, like that, I will cut them up, like nice and beautiful, yeah. As I said today, you know, when, you, when I'm in the kitchen, you know, I don't only just, I like to, you know, just as my grandmother used to do, cook and clean at the same time, you know? That's very important, you know, because I can't really cook and then see things dirty, you know, you know, I have to cook and, you know, and clean up at the same time. And that's something I noticed on YouTube, a lot of people, they just tap, 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 cook, 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 with some dirty environment. That's not good. So that's why I seen today, I want to show full details of what I'm doing from start to end. Now I'm gonna chop this up, you know. Now I wash it like clean and nice already, you know. So I'm gonna chop out first the stem, you know. Just move that one there first. And then again, you see knife? Knife is a thing you should have. You see, I got all type of knife. I got fish knife. I got a knife for everything. I even have a knife to cut butter. <laughs> I love ya. I'm just joking, you know. Yeah, cut up the spinner. Cut up the spinach, you know? Yes, you know, greens is a thing that I love, you know? And today, something important, right? As I said before, if you notice when I'm making my food, I don't use so many different types of seasoning. That's why I use a lot of vegetables, a lot of greens and things, right? And I try to not season them too much, you know? When I say with all this kind of a powder seasoning, you know? Yeah, today you're gonna see my favorite seasoning. Actually, I make my seasoning for myself most of the time. And then, you know, a few little things I put together, you know, like chili sauce, you know, which I call the boss, you know. Yeah, and you know, with olive oil is something I always use. Not lots of olive oil, you know. Now, I will cut this up, eh? As I said, I'm putting that in the oven, you know. I'm going to like grill that actually, you know. So when I cut them up, I will season it. So pay attention. It's my intention. That's my dear people, as I said before, a lot of you who actually watch my video, I hope today you will start to give me some subscription. It's not a thing I always talk about, right? Because I, I said already I'm going to upload a video now Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And most of the videos I will do, I will try to give the full details of the recipe. And um, this idea come from my comments, you know, as I said before, I, I I always want to do that, you know, I didn't ready for it. But based on what I said before, if you keep doing things like just how you want it, you can call that a selfish content. I don't want to do that. So actually, I want to please as much people as possible. Yes, always wash out the thing. I like to wash my thing. I love, if, if there's no water, go, okay, okay, I must have water. Now let me start. 
This is my seasoning. Now, if you watch what I do a lot of time, and this is my pepper sauce. I haven't called it pepper, I call it flavor sauce because of the ingredients that I use. A touch of olive oil. Now this, this is this is something, and then as I said, chili sauce, the boss, and fresh garlic, you know? Now this is something I do a couple of times well before, but as I said, I, I, I got 410 videos now, I think, on that channel. So I know I did do a, some of them, which I, I show the recipe, right? A touch of salt. I don't have to be my herbal salt, you know? So I'm going to use some, not too much salt, just not, you know, just a touch, you know? And mix that up. Now I have something else after that, eh? And um, it's coming, I'm going to show you why. I'm going to put some carrots also in this, you know? But, ah, now, Eagle Logic Coconut. I find that today, you know? This is the carrot. Now, the reason why you didn't see the carrots there, I pre-cook the carrot, you know, soften it a little because in the tree of them there, carrot is a little bit harder one, you know? So when I'm grilling it, I want them to be like equal grill, <laughs> as you can see, equal grill. And now, mix it up. Not, you see, not too much coconut water, eh? I just put a little touch in a way so you could um, into the oven. Now I'm going to grill that till it's ready. Maybe about 20 to 25 minutes, I don't know, you know, as I said, I, I just do things, look at it, I use my eyes. And this is the pumpkin, spinner. I cook some nice rice with some linsel, easy cooking linsel. That rice also is very easy to cook. It's very nice rice. I think it's the first time I'm using this rice. I saw it today and I said, let me try this rice. A little bit expensive, but I say, it's not always good to buy the cheapest thing, you know? That's not so good, you know? I like that rice. I eat it already. I will think I will use it sometimes if I want to cook rice, you know? And always wash out the rice too, because a lot of people sometimes they think that, oh, they'll give it, you know, three times. I like to wash my rice till I see, because the peas also is a little bit dirty, right? And then I put the, um, the spinner. So spinner, pumpkin, rice, and peas, you know, and just a touch of salt. Now, this is the rice now, a fresh salmon. In, in Swedish, they say lax, L-A-X. Now, what you can see, I remove the skin of the lax. I don't really offer the salmon too, as I said. I don't really like, some people grill lax and thing with all these, you know, man. Because I have sauce and, you know, other things in it. So I don't want no scale and no skin around it, you know. And as I said before, you must have a fish knife. Because next time I do this, I will show you how I take it off, you know. That's the only thing I think I didn't show you today, you know. Okay, now let's get a seasoning. I'm going to make, I'm going to make, you know, a thing for it now. What do you call it? A sauce or a seasoning, right? Da -da -da. Let's get it. First, I didn't have fresh lemon. Sometimes, a touch of salt. You know, if I don't have lemon, I will go and get eh? a touch of olive oil. And then some fresh garlic. Lalic, lalic, garlic, garlic. <laughs> you remember the days when they used to say, lalic, garlic. Yes, I'm addicted to garlic too, you know. I just don't know. It's just it's a thing I like. I like to smell it, you know what I mean? And um, my, I always remember my grandmother used to say, it's two things you must always have in your food. If you don't have it, go get it. And a piece of ginger too. I will put a piece of ginger today. It's garlic and lemon. And of course, you see my flavor sauce? If you watch how I do that, I got all type of things in it. I got garlic, you know, thyme. It's like my seasoning to the one I'm just putting in. You see, I don't put a lot, right? Because I, I call it flavor the flavor. And chili sauce, the boss. <laughs> I'm really addicted to that one. Again, not a lot. Not to junk it. And nah, not that. I, I don't want um, curry. The another one, bring it. Yes, turmeric. I want to put a touch of that too. You know? Now look at what I'm doing. You see, again, I, I just a touch. Because, you know, not too much to, you know, I will. And then the coconut. Everything is just a touch. Not plenty in one, you know, not too much. Can I, what you call it, you know, equalize it. You know? <laughs> equalize it, you know, yeah. Need a store. Ah, one more thing to go, eh? One more thing to put. And yeah, a, a little bit more lemon. I still have something else to put, right? You got to check this carefully. This is something that is, ooh, is a, a touch of cayenne pepper well powder cayenne you know and mix it up that's it now there and i'm going to pour that onto the fish put it in the oven and bake it for a while or grill it and it's almost finished already you know my you know food is coming everything will be soon done in the oven right i'm going to grill that for but this is very easy to grill i wouldn't overcook it because if you grill it too much it'll be covered with a hand so i might grill that for about 20 minutes you know what i mean that's the rice, you see the pumpkin and the everything and look at the food. 
So now that's a presentation plate, a bit of everything. My dear people, thank you for watching or viewing. Keep in tune, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, video coming your way. Love you all, from the Love Kitchen.